let's go to Slan Firepol Squingus. Go get it, Juan Drobo, Slan to Silio, go, go, go. <laughs> it didn't even write it, its full name on the sign. Oh, a bit more of it there. So we're at a railway station. Really, Sherlock? Yeah. Hey, <laughs> there is the name of the town. <laughs> That's ridiculous. And uh, for people alighting, that's what they see on the platform. <laughs> and uh, the station house was restored in 1994. They found a piece of slate <laughs> big enough and worthy enough for that. Oh my God. Well, they might as well milk it because there's nothing here except that name. And in case you haven't quite got the idea yet, there it is. <laughs> the entire facade of that railway station is the name, <laughs> the name of this town. Once again, <laughs> I can stop laughing. <laughs> Slan fire pulse gwingith go get a huan drop or slant a silly or go go go. Now to non Welsh speakers uh, watching, I hardly speak much Welsh because I'm from the south of Wales originally, but if you're wondering what it means, a lot of uh, Welsh village names kind of describe the main landmarks and how you get there. Uh, a bit like, I suppose, English town names did in the original Latin or Swedish, whatever, whichever invader uh, took over England at the time. So here's the English meaning. Are you ready? The Church of Mary in the hollow of the white hazel near the fierce whirlpool and the church of Tosilio by the Red Cave. Oh, I need to sit down after reading that. But uh, picnic tables are soaked. Oh, oh the <laughs> there's another one. I can't even get that in on a wide angle. How far away do I have to walk to see that? Hang on, let's get it above my head. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, there you go. That'll be the thumbnail. Although I, n I never, uh, <laughs> never choose the thumbnail. I think uh, I could replace that uh, window flag that got damaged. Hmm. And if you're curious about the rest of the village. Alright, yeah, there it is, job done. And there's the advantage of having a 2014 Transit Connect L2. You can put your bike in the back, probably everything you need and a bed as well. A man can dream. Can't he? But there is one redeeming feature of Fanfire. Fanfire Plus Quingith. Go get a coin drop of Lancelli Go Go Go. And that's at the back of the co op here. There's a scraggly car park where nobody minds if you stay here. And I'm going to put that to the test this evening. And there's a chippy and a Chinese. Huh. And a pub and hotel, if those things are still allowed. Yeah. 
Nice one, JW. Why, when you ask for duck and orange in Chinese restaurants, do they throw in pineapples as well? I've had some cases where they don't even pull in the orange. I've been looking at my ceiling. It's a vapour barrier. It's a kind of a foil covered bubble wrap. But in each of these little foil bubbles is a different symbol. I mean, some there you can see monsters biting, others you can see samurais drawing their swords. Some are various icons from culture. There's E.T. there. There's obviously a jelly baby lying down on its side there. And they're all so very different. That's a crinkle chip there, remember them? Don't make them like that anymore. And uh, various, obviously, farmyard animals and zoo animals going on. And it's just incredible, the difference between them. And you begin to wonder... I forgot what I was wondering now. Oh yeah, yeah, I was wondering how many different ones <laughs> are there, or if there's a repeating pattern, or is it entirely just a random process of how the bubble wrap process happened in the factory, where there was never a requirement for them to be perfectly identical as long as they just held an air bubble between the plastic and the foil. But, oh wow, beautiful works of art, each and every one of them. Wow. Oh, my goodness, they're so beautiful. It's still better than television by a long way. And it was at that moment I realized it's 11.36 a.m. I've just seen the entire internet, right? All of YouTube and all of BitChute. I've seen all of it. And it's time <laughs> to realize that I'm in Flan Vai Porth Quingis Go Gerrit Flan Drobo Flan Tazilio Go Go Go. I should just get up and go and see the Menai Bridge and Beaumaris Castle. Yeah. And that's all after. That's actually a catchphrase, and that's all after. A bed bath. I haven't bothered to edit and publish a video in three days. I mean, that sunset on Snowdonia has been up there three days now. And I did start editing my journey through the Thlain Peninsula from Porth Maddock to the, the tip of it. And uh, it was just, um, the story wasn't really going anywhere, you know. It's mostly just uh, like dash cam shots and... Uh, I kind of run out of steam editing it, so, yeah, have another look at that today. See if maybe I could find a piece of music to put over it that makes it pop back to life again, or, or just <laughs> release a dud video. <laughs> I don't often deliberately release dud videos, but uh, I, have a <laughs> I have a feeling a lot of YouTubers do. Van lifers too. <sighs> Alright, underpants, t-shirt. Ooh, sandwiches. Chicken triple, probably still okay. Yes. Yes. I'll go for the... The most horrible one first, which is the chicken and stuffing. 
Anything that makes me gag, it'll be that. Mmm. Easy. Oh yeah, before I leave, I stand five to go and get go get a coin job or stand silly go go go. I should pop into the souvenir shop and get another Welsh door flag. There is a co-op delivery lorry here at 6 a.m. Just banging and dropping and scraping. Uh, oh, an emergency gin. Nomadic Kango. That is Jordan's. None of your that uh, Gordon's. None of your uh, little or Aldi stuff. Not even Marks and Spencers. That's the real deal. So I'm back at the souvenir shop. There are two coach loads. And a full car park. Have another look at that crazy town name again before we leave. And on the souvenir shop, of course. Uh, yeah. Alright, let's fix this little problem that has been waiting for this moment for a very long time. It is done.